Alright guys, this is uh, Pitching Ace 88. We are back playing Resident Evil uh, from probably a long hiatus. I don't really quite remember what time it is, but um, I have gotten a uh, better setup. I got a new microphone. Uh, cost me a little bit, but hopefully that you guys will be able to hear me a lot better. Uh, I don't really remember quite where I am. Ooh, a shooting gallery. I'll have to be able to hit that up. Uh, and then I also you know, new computer, so let's see, I gotta remember where I am. Uh, so, that's pretty much just what's been happening. Um, that and, you know, been working 24, 25 hours a week. Welcome. And then I don't know what happened, what the reason with the, uh, ooh, wait, oh, right, gun. Striker. I don't need that just yet. But I don't really know what the what the big deal about uh, about that green line is. Uh, if anyone is watching this and can hopefully do this really quickly, because I'm probably gonna just try and run off as many of these videos as I can. But hopefully you can help me out. But let's read Luis's memo too. Wow, this is pretty long. First, Castellan buried the Las Plagas deep underground below the castle to hide their very existence. But when Salazar released the Las Plagas, no one thought he could bring them back to life. Because when Salazar found them, they were all just fossilized remains. Everyone knew that the parasite, parasitic organisms could not survive without hosts, that they couldn't sustain life on their own. But when Salazar and his men excavated the remains, it almost appears that the Las Plagas were just waiting to be discovered so that they could be resurrected. Several years later, unexplainable convulsions started occurring among the villagers who helped with the excavation of the Las Plagas. Then one day, all of a sudden, these villagers turned into violent savages. They later found out it was caused by the Las Plagas. Although they appeared fossilized, they were able to survive the long years by laying in a dormant state at the cellular, cellular level, remaining in a spore-like form. Apparently, during the excavation, the villagers inhaled the spores, and within their bodies, the parasites became active again. This is how the Las Plagas were resurrected. Even as I'm writing, the excavation of the Las Plagas continues. God only knows how many of these Las Plagas have been resurrected, not to mention the countless number of ganados that have been created. Their inhumane activity must be put to an end. If they're not stopped, people around the world could turn into victims of this crazy cult organization. Okay, cool. Um, <clears throat> sorry about that. Um, but yeah, I'm looking. Uh, and then I was able, also able to figure Ooh, out audacity. Um, I had been using just some, not this microphone. I've been using another, another mic, my old microphone. That uh, I don't want that one. I want uh, change weapons. Sorry, not paying attention. Sniping. Yes. But it, it had been picking up another microphone that I had been using, which is not good. <laughs> um, but, so now it should be better. Uh, select game type. Uh, I don't know. Uh, C, maybe? Gosh, I haven't played this thing in forever. Oh, there's a guy. probably good because it'll, it'll help me out um, practicing, but I don't... Yeah, because I'm doing really poorly with my, with my speed and my reaction time at least. Prizes awarded. Okay, so maybe I do need to go to C. Because I know I already finished, I guess, one. Uh oh. Crap. Ah! Gosh darn it, this is not good. Uh oh. Okay. 
Can I just, oh my gosh, this is, this is pitiful. Maybe you can't go negative points, so maybe I can be okay. Wow. Yeah, I figured he was gonna laugh at me. Okay. Let's try this. No, 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 let's leave. No, okay, go back. Yeah, you know what I need to do. You need to do, which is actually helpful, is, is st take a step back. Shoot. Crap. That's the easiest one right there. Shoot. We need that 500. Yeah. Okay. Good. So this is this isn't gonna be pretty, but. Hopefully we can get the job done. Ooh, close. That actually wasn't that bad. As long as I don't screw up, and I don't believe there's another Ashley. I can't remember. So I can't really screw up too poorly. Ah, missed that one though. Ah. So it's five in a row, and then the Salazar head in the back pops up, which you can hit. So as long as your prizes are going up, wow, I think that's actually one of my best scores I've gotten. Let's go back to C. My innate sense of, a of killing Ashley, I almost got her. Alright, let's do this. Uh, one, two, three. Ah! Get, God. Gosh darn it, I guess I should say. that one. Oh, I still should have gotten over three. Yeah, I got over 3,000. Good. Alright, so. Uh-oh. Yeah, I, I, I thought so. They change it on you. Shoot. Oh, jeez, there's an action. Nice. Okay, so this is a whole different pattern for, like, the last two. Wow, this is going to take a lot of skill. Or luck. God. I just need to, I just need to hit someone. Oh, there we go. That always works. Okay, I have no clue. Oh good, just barely made it. I just need to do it one more time. There's a guy that comes up, and then a guy that comes back. These two guys. Ah. One, shoot. I'll get the one farther away. Okay, and then what happens? And then you got three, three stooges. I hit that guy. Oh, I thought I got him in the head. Okay, I need to reload because you got the dynamite guy coming. Oh, there we go. Dynamite guy will always get you the Salazar head in the back. Okay. So, I got six prizes, which should mean 
You've been worth six bottle caps. Third row is completed. Okay, sweet. I don't even think I've showed you guys that yet, so I will. Or the other two ones. Oh, okay, well, I guess I have to do this, the second row. So, you know what? I'll go do the second row. Uh, talk. I'm going to do the second row now because I totally did not know that.